Yo, it's Ross, and uh, for those of you who remember my video on growing things vertically, this is kind of another sneak preview here. Um, essentially, what we're trying to do is grow different annual vegetables uh, vertically up poles. This way, you save more space, you grow more food in uh, a smaller space, you know, a higher density of food, and it's pretty cool too. It's also just a really cool thing, right? It's three feet off the ground is that is that melon right there. Um, I'm curious to know from you guys though, in addition to me just showing you this, you know, there's a few other melons out there um, that have melons on them now. There's plenty of tomatoes that have, you know, tomatoes on them and they're growing vertically. Uh, but this is the first year doing melons of any kind. And I'm curious to know, how many days from today will this take to ripen, right? It definitely depends on the variety. But how many days from today will say that this melon here is pollinated, right? How many days from that being pollinated will it take for me to get a fresh, um, well-ripened melon, right? So for those of you who are melon experts out there, let me know. I would love to find something you know, this melon right next to it is also getting all kinds of melons on them. And they're easily 10 feet tall. You know, the poles are 10 feet tall. And the top of that thing, even though it's coming down, if I straighten it up, it's, it's over 10 feet tall. Um, and then we have another vine back over there with some melons on it. And we have a whole bed of this, of this stuff, guys. We have one down here that's just a, a lot slower to get started for me. We have a whole bed of these guys that are coming along now. And, you know, they don't have melons on them yet. Um, I think because the bed is, is not as fertile and it, it was quite dry and I didn't realize how dry it was. And it was impeding the growth for about a month. But, you know, I'm curious to know exactly how much time I have left because in the terms of figs, right, you know, a small fig that's pea-sized has 90 days from today, August 1st, to ripen. Um, it takes 90 days. But how long does it take for a melon to ripen from pea-sized, right? I don't know. So, anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this little short video on um, the progress of what's going on vertically. I'll show you guys this 